Okay guys, hope you're all doing well, it's Handy Andy here of ASM Property Services here for another tutorial video. Very simple video today, we have a paint scuttle. Now this is a small paint scuttle and we are using a 4 inch roller today. Now we could just pour paint straight into this, however you do do this and you end up with a lot of cleaning, especially if you're going to change colours at some point in the job. Now, you can buy disposable liners for these and you can also buy like a gel type one which is like a rubbery silicone gel type thing that just fits in. However, you do need the make of the um, scuttle that you're using and some of them don't fit correctly which is annoying. Now, there's a couple of things you can do that would help you out with not having to clean out the scuttle every time you want to change colour. One is you could just buy another one. Uh, two is you could line it. Now, in a previous video I mentioned polythene dust sheets. Now this comes on a roll, it is 50 metres long, it is 2 metres wide. I've got the packet here. Polythene dust sheet. Cost me around £7, we'll call it under the tenner here in the UK, probably pick this up online, decorating stores will have it, most major retailers will probably stock it somewhere. It's very good, 2 metres wide, 50 metres long. How many dust sheets have you bought for a couple of quid, used them once, thrown away and thinking, oh that was a good idea, but once you've used two or three and you think, hang on, I needed a couple more. By the time you've bought a couple more, you've spent seven quid, tenner, easy. Polythene dust sheet, 50 metre roll, that lasts me for quite a while to be honest. I bring it to jobs, cover people's furniture up with it, I cover the house up with it. It looks like an episode of Dexter when I've done sometimes. And um, nearly all the jobs where I'm going to be creating a lot of mess, dust or anything that I'm doing, dust sheets. Always handy, handy to have some in your van or car, whatever vehicle you're using, but another use for it is line your scuttle. So all you basically do is you just need to cut a bit off. Now another thing, polythene off any wrappers that you've got, anything that you've bought, you can just simply line up, line your scuttle with that, put it inside, simple as that, and Bob's your uncle, as they say. All I'm doing is putting that inside the scuttle, making sure it's covering all the edges. And there you go. There's your, there's your scuttle liner, temporary, I know. Great, great idea though. So what we're going to do is I'm going to cut some polythene off. Knife. Polythene, cut it off. Open it out, make sure you've got enough and line your scuttle. Very simple, you can double it over as well if you want to. Quite easy to do. Then all you need to do is get your masking tape and if you've got some that's already prepared, can't find the end on that one and just run it around the edge. So, simple. Cut it off, that's my teeth. Out of the dentist, mate. Another tip, just go fetch your brush, Let's say you're using a brush in your scuttle, dipping it, you wipe it on the edge like that. Another thing you can do is put a bit of masking tape on the corner. 
Like that. And you've got somewhere to wipe the excess off your brush. Simple, effective. Once you've done, undo the masking tape, whip it out, and it's clean inside, isn't it? Use it. Use another bit of polythene, like I say, plastic bag. Bags from the supermarket work as well as long as they've got no holes in. So you know, obviously they have holes in some of the supermarket bags to prevent kids suffocating because they put them over their heads sometimes, which isn't a good idea. But you know, babies and that, you know, that it has happened in the past, unfortunately. But yeah, if you if you've got any like plastic bags, any any polythene of any sort, line your scuttle with it. That will sort you out. So there you go. That's another informative video that you've had today. And I hope you enjoyed the channel. Thanks for all your support. Thanks for everybody who's buying me a coffee at the moment. Uh, it's much appreciated. Links down in the description of things that I use. I use them in the description. All the polythene you probably get it from any supplier. But I will find some suppliers online for you that will be able to help you with this polythene. Um, but yeah. Yeah. Uh, like I say, hope you enjoy the video, hope you've got something out of it, and I'll catch you in another video soon. Thanks for watching.